the nine nine I just came from. So I wrapped up my 54th birthday, January 29th, 2016, Douglas Stewart, up in Middleton Settlement, Blue Mountains, Jamaica, with a Ninite. That was fantastic. And I just made my way over to the place I'm staying to, Prince Valley, where I'm staying. And um, it was what, like four, in the, four o'clock in the morning? It was better than going to a club. Fantastic, fantastic. Soup to nuts. And it's still going strong. We'll probably go till morning. Till the sun comes up. And okay, I want you all to see something. The moon. Are you ready? No, no, that's not it. Here it comes. Look at this freakish moon. I was walking along and I thought, I thought it was like a lamp. I thought, How's that lamp following me around? I wanted to say lamp, there's that these lamps are so bright. And I looked up and I went, oh my god, that's the moon. I've never seen such a bright moon. I mean, it still looks like an artificial, like it's a lamp. It's fantastic. Look at it. Anyway, mountain life, man, you're closer up. Well, up here, anyway. Wow. Anyway, so I need to get a little bit of this flavor. I mean, yes, I have other video that I, I you know, my poor little to be erasing old videos and then um, the battery eventually died because it was so good. I love Nine Nights. I mean, it's too bad it's going to die for them to happen, but those bands, listen to that voice. What's that voice? And the band. I mean, this is there's a phenomenon in this country with nine night bands, nine night bands and singers. And I, if anything, I probably should get some funding and do a project on them because there's something about them. Looks that talent. I'm trying to understand if they do like weddings. Do they do other things? Because they're so talented. And then these particular ones that just have these voices. That voice. And they're all over this country. And sometimes there's their men with that voice, and then there are women with that voice. It's a woman tonight. And there's these songs that are particular to Jamaica. I mean, I think Grenada is the only other place I know that comes close. There it is. She just, you know, but often she just segues into another song. It reminds me of being in Ghana and going to these. Um, clubs, these sort of performance clubs where these bands would just play non-stop through the night and then have sometimes just switch people, like another singer would come on or another guitarist, they just have people sort of like just change positions in the middle of the, these songs that just never ended, they just go from song to song and this is what this reminds me of, they just go from, you know the switch will be into another song and it will be just seamless this is that and this is like across the valley there. This, uh, these hills are very deceiving. You know, you look at them and you think, oh my God, how do you get over there? How do you get over there? And then you start walking and think, oh, like, you know, you know it's actually all connected. The things aren't actually as far as you think. I mean, initially you're like, oh God, Lord. But then now I'm like, you know, I'm skipping a jump, but I'm there. I guess it's just getting used to something, you know, it just seems, yeah. It's like winter, you know, for people when you first go, you think, oh God, how can I serve a fucking freezing place? And then eventually winter comes in, you just put on your coat and your boots to you go. And your gloves, and your scarf, I mean, you complain. But you just go about your business. So same here. All right, at some point I need to stop this. Good day. Okay, I'm gonna let it go to six minutes. Sure, it should have just been three, but you know me. And it was gonna be five. And now, I think she's into another song now, so we'll give you a little bit of that and then we'll go. 
How you doing? Good morning. <laughs> How you doing? Good morning.